frog. Well, let's see what happens when he's approached by a frog. So he doesn't cry help me when a frog shows up. Yeah. Sure. Well, here's Tebow. He just tells you about these pads here. Basically, you have to step on all the circle ones. If you step on the ones with crosses, it resets the rest of them. Now, what he said uh, back there about <laughs> the frog, I mean, not the frog, the fly. Um, I watched the movie again a little while ago, and I... I'm thinking back to the part where he tried to join the other llamas and he was eating the grass. He clearly didn't like it, so... <laughs> I, I'm, okay, I'm probably reading too deep into this game. <laughs> but I, I just had to uh, mention that. Just thinking about it. Something to think about. Like, he doesn't have the instinct to, you know, favor grass. Because, you know, he may even turn into a llama, but, you know, uh, I guess mentally he's still a human being. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. So why does he want to eat the frog? I mean, the uh, fly. Why do I keep saying frog? Huh. Okay, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna leave this alone now. Come on, reset. Yeah, I probably won't get all the coins. Oh. <sighs> well, at least I got it open. Alright, I believe there's a red idol here. Yep, I see it. Wait, no, I had to... I shouldn't have kept going. See, people, this is why I don't do playthroughs blind. I, sh I should have, uh, practiced this first. Wait a minute. Actually, I did practice because I was trying to get to that, that secret that had to continue. I practiced that for a little while. But I probably should have kept going. Oh! And I shouldn't rush. I always rush. Alright. Uh, okay, I think this is the last part. Follow the fly. Yeah, you don't even have to jump. Just follow the fly. I jumped there. I'm impatient. <laughs> coins here. No. Get. What am I talking about? I probably, I probably missed some coins when I was jumping for that idol. <laughs> Man, that's rough. <laughs> I mean, he's turned into a llama, a turtle, and then a frog. Checkpoint. But we can't really say it all in the same day, because we did go through the jungle night uh, level. And now it's broad daylight. Can I shoot the... Let's have a look -see. Uh, did it just jump over there? Okay, again. This is just my curiosity. Uh, I guess I can't. No. Hey, 
Yeah, it's funny. They can hold off. Uh, Demon Llama Spit can hold off crocodiles in the uh, river level, but it can't shoot a little bird. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, is there a secret here? Yeah. Now, here's a part that threw me off for a long time when I was little. Let's talk to Pacha first. Hey, Kuzco, are you hungry? You and your stomach. I heard there's a red idol around here somewhere. And you didn't get it for me. I couldn't see it. I gotta eat. But the food is awful here. Have you found that red idol yet? Yeah. It took me a while to figure this out, but I finally did. Um, let's see. You have to look up to... I guess when you first start the level, seeing this thing is pretty much a clue. You'll notice there's actually a target in his mouth. I mean, it's kind of small, but you look hard enough, you can see it. Oh, it turned gold! I got all the coins. Yes! Well, I don't know how far I'm gonna go today. I wanna at least make it past the city, because... Well, I haven't... I haven't been doing this. Actually, I should have been uh, practicing the uh, catacombs level, because that's the level that I'm... <laughs> I'm Probably going to go insane. <laughs> but I really like the music in this level. These mountains are very dangerous. Stick with me. Sure. <laughs> nice footwork, Chunky. Another thing I love about this game, Kuzco pretty much, uh, well, he Sorry, makes fun of Pacha's weight every time he says something. Well, not, okay, maybe not every time. And Pacha doesn't really say anything about it. Watch out for scorpions. If you come across them, charge them twice. That'll stop them. Hey, I can look after myself. Yeah, that's all Pacha gets. No thank you, no thanks for the advice. Nothing. <laughs> And he says charge, but you really don't have to charge them. Just tumble into them a couple Ow. of times. There's gonna be some blue ones, and I think you have to... I think you just have to tumble into them once. What's the repeat? Some machine statues and control. Uh, you and your dumb villagers built this? And it still works? Unfortunately, this one won't take my weight. Too bad. So long, cousin. I hate it when the audio messes up. Probably couldn't hear that first thing he said. But yeah, with the scorpions, just tumble into them a couple of times. You only have to tumble into the blue ones once, which is kind of interesting. Because it, wait a minute, I think there's a guard around here. Okay, no. Good. Probably catch me off guard anyway. But yeah. I don't know who in their right mind would want to cook scorpions, but... Uh, it seems like the ones that are like a reddish-brownish color... They're more feisty. It's like they were, you know, it's like they knew people were trying to cook them. <laughs> and now if you hit them once, that just makes them mad. It doesn't matter. But the blue ones, the ones that don't show any sign of, you know, getting tackled, they just go down once. <laughs> it's like the lighter colored one said, you tried to cook me. <laughs> I kill you. <laughs> 
Yeah, I, I'm reading way too deep into this game. I don't know why. Wait a minute. Yeah, this is another thing that kind of threw me off when I was little. And I'll show you what I'm talking about when I get all the statues out there. brought those spiders back. Eh. I think after this, you don't see them anymore. Yeah, after the mountains, you don't see the spiders or the scorpions anymore. Because, well, you might see the scorpions. But I don't think you see the spiders anymore. Because you're pretty much, you're headed for the city now, so... All you really have to worry about are the guards. And that sneaking around thing that we had to do in the uh, in the Jungle Day chapters. They, um... Yeah, we're gonna be seeing them again. So yeah, we have to do the sneaking around thing. And it's gonna be a little trickier because uh, you're gonna have to do some puzzles. Well, not puzzles. I think you're gonna be timed or something. Huh? But yeah, this is what threw me off. I thought he had to uh, um, go by Shores to Tallis. Because you see how uh, small uh, some of these statues are. But you have to go by uh, the lines. See, uh, the blue lines, they pretty much represent where the platforms go. Is this the one where we see Condor Man? I don't think this is it. I think it's the second chapter? It might be the second chapter. And I see a gold coin up there. Wait. Uh, yeah, I, I remember. There's, there's a few guards that take me by surprise. <laughs> it's annoying because they usually have the one that throws uh, axes at you and you don't even see it coming because <laughs> you have to turn a corner first. And it's even more annoying when you have to uh, carry something because you can't attack while you're carrying something. <laughs> 